Hi guys, it's Jody. Today's video is not going to be about testing something today. <laughs> We're going to have fun and just paint. Um, but I wanted to come on here and tell you kind of what I was going to be painting. I've been challenged by one of my friends, Muna from Mona Rose Art. I'm going to link her channel below. She's got some really beautiful pieces that she does over there and great tips and tips and tricks on her channel. So go check her out. Um, but she has put the challenge out to use some of these, this little piggy pigments. And so I am to use the Sapphire, the Harvest Gold, and then the Sequins, which is, it's a, um, interference color. And I always, I always mess these up. I'm not sure if it's an interference violet or um, a mix, a, like a red. I'll have to get back to you on that. I, I can go look it up. I just don't have it with me. But anyways, the sequence. Yeah, so um, using those three pigments and then um, like two or three tube paints. So I decided uh, to use a few of my favorite Joe Sonia colors. I'm going to use the red violet, the aqua, and then the green light for a nice rainbow effect. So we're going to, we're going to see what happens with this. I'm, I'm pretty excited. Um, and uh, as always before, um, in the beginning of the video here, I always put, um, what pouring mediums I'm going to be using. I like to use with pigments. I've been using the bare Glidden a lot. Um, and that seems to work really well for pigments, iridescence and all that. And then for regular tube paints, anything non-iridescent, I like to use the Glidden Min Wax. So I'll be using that for the two paints that you just saw. And you'll see pictures of it at the beginning of the video and how I mix it. And it's also down in the description box. All the colors I've used, where you can get them, how I've mixed them, <laughs> all that good stuff. So enough of that. Let's go get started and have some fun with these colors. <laughs> 